seven, six, five, right, hopefully the timer five, is starting four, now. Three, two, one, zero. Good luck, everybody. Now, this is two minutes, so you don't have to go crazy fast, but it's faster than regular blitz. I think I'd better drop back there. Maybe even F3 is playable here. If he takes, I can take with the knight now. Very tricky start to the tournament. Now do a sack. I've got to be careful that the rook hangs there, the knight blocks the other rook. But how do I get a knight here? I need to move the bishop. I want the knight round here if I can. Oh, I've blundered, okay. He'll check, I'm guessing he doesn't. Yeah, this is just lost already, I think. Okay, we might get forward. Okay, he goes back. If I take, feels wrong. I don't really see what I can do in this position. Oh, we just pins our curve. Yeah, there's nothing I can do here, so I just made a mistake earlier on. I've still got maybe pawn forward. Queen covers the check. Oh, he, he made a mistake, wow. He made a mistake in a one position. Very lucky, very lucky. You need luck in this game when you're playing bullet and blitz, of course. Trading Castle. Hmm. Trying to take the knight. We will take if we can. So bishop back, maybe queen up. So hit the bishop. Potential sacks coming, you never know. Okay. Can I take? King takes up. I don't think it works. Ooh. 
Ooh, the sword and a tactic. Is there a tactic? There isn't. Knight check, knight check. Now, the ideas of going in this way though, sacking. Okay, I need to play h3 or something. Or I can take now. So threaten the same check again. Getting behind on the clock here. Threaten to take. Is that checkmate? It is. Well done. Well done. Very nicely finished. Hmm, actually, I was going to go for a very attacking sacrifice there, but I warned. I know I'm going to line up H4, H5 if I can. I think I'll go forward. Now I'm going to try and play this. It's probably dubious. Let's play it anyway. So it comes forward. I think I can take there. If he takes the knight, I take the pawn. I think. If he takes the pawn back, I take the bishop, or I take anywhere. Now, do you check first? I think it's queen. Hmm, I think he survived it. I think he survived it. Wow. Got to push forward. It's all I'll bust this. Oh, he's gambled. He's taken. Okay. Okay, so he's got to check. What? Can he play that? Let's just take, simplify. Let's throw in a check. Oh, he's played really well, hasn't he? He's played really, really good game. checks. So let's go across threatening a check. Right, I've really got to quicken up now. It should be a draw this by rights, but oh, I've blundered it. I have blundered it badly. Blunder this badly, it should be a loss by rights now. It 
This is hideous. Wow. How on earth have I done this? Okay, well played. Right, play a Karakalan. Which way do we go? Hit the bishop. Ooh. He just played too quick and dropped the bishop. Hmm. If you don't want the rook there, he's going to play a rook across. So I think I need pawn forward. Hit the pawn. And hopefully knight down to defend, or rook down. So try and go in. Right, rook across. Wow. What on earth do I do here? Can't he just take? No, he can. Wow. Oh, it's checkmate. What a shocking game that was. Should have been an easy win there. Should have been a really straightforward win. Well, let's play you four this time. How does this go now? Hmm. So I've made a bit of a mess of this one as well. I very rarely play for though, I very rarely play it. So I know very little in the way of the theory. Okay, allows me a trade, but I can bring his king up. Actually, let's take a risk. Let's just take a risk instead. Can't take now because of the pin on the rook. I'm threatening to take with a pin on the queen. So I can grab a pawn, we pin on the queen. Ooh, I missed that. Wow. Gain a queen, lose a queen, a check. Wow. Completely missed that. Very, very well done. Just make sure we've given the king some sort of square. Oh, the rook hangs. But if we go forward, we're threatening mate. He's got to be a little bit careful if he tries to attack too much. Right, so now he's gone defensive. Mm -hmm. So we're threatening to play rook forward, which is easy to miss. Easy to miss that it's a threat, and we're also hitting the pawn. It's five pawns each. I'm down on the clock though. So rook down, how does he get back? Q4. 
queen down. Okay, grab the pawn first. Oh, have I given him a repetition? Okay. So I'm going to look to try and get the rook off now. If I go up, he's got a check again. So let's cover the check diagonal. Oh, he just blundered the queen. I've just covered it and he's blundered it. Wow. A bit lucky there. You always need luck in this game, though. Okay, very attacking Karakhan. Now he's trying to play really, really fast. I don't think you really need to do that. Not in a two minute game. Up. He might try and bring the knight round, he just takes, so let's bring a pawn over. Okay, why has he done that? I'm looking at maybe a break at some point with pawn up, he plays up. I've got knight up, takes, takes, don't quite like the look of that. So I'll hit the pawn. If bishop up this way, we've also got pawn here. If takes, we can try and advance and hit. Alright, so that weakens his position, so bring the bishop back and then pawn up. Oh, pawn up here, now the knight's pinned. Throw a pawn forward first. I'm going to bring the rook into play. Okay, that's a very bold move. Very bold. So now I'm ready to attack. So the knight is pinned. Important to note that the knight's pinned. So we're threatening to push up hit the bishop, threatening to bring the queen up, he comes forward, so queen up he can come in, can take, you know what, let's play a knight up, but we're getting to the point where we have to kick in the bullet mode shortly, So we're hitting the knight, we're hitting the pawn potentially. Okay, we can trade and grab a pawn, I think that looks good. Hit the pawn. Seriously doing that? Right, now we've got time to think, keep him tied down. Yeah, he's out of time, isn't he? Right, that's excellent, good win. Taken, I chose not to. He's given me a fork. 
we take to the bishop, you take the queen first, so you can take with bishop or knight. Trade the queen because you're going to piece up. Grab the pawn, hit the rook. Okay, so this pawn is loose. So let's not give a pawn away. Okay, I could take that actually. Ah, he gets the bishop fork at the end, doesn't he? Take, 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 bishop in. He does indeed, so bring the knight up. It looked like a free pawn, but it wasn't. So hit the bishop, up to trade a piece. See, we're hitting this bishop, but he takes. So, oh, I thought he'd play knight over, he doesn't. Just drop right back, cover the back rank. So I hit the pawn. He plays across, so I've got knight in. I'm going to break this pin so I can potentially move this pawn. Okay, I bring the cross, look to trade a rook. It comes forward. I might be blundering something here. Wow, I have blundered something, haven't I? I've got to take. I've really blundered this very badly. Wow, I might be lost here. I can check, and if he takes to the knight, I take the bishop. If he doesn't, I take the knight. If he checks, I block. And if he knight checks, I can drop back. So he's got to watch his rook. He's been really well here. He's played really, really well for a 1600. Oh, can I trap the knight? No, I've got to take the pawn. But now his knight's in trouble. this aren't I? You can just see it coming. Oh I could have pinned his knight, what am I doing? That would have been game over, pin the knight. Would have been game over. I'm gonna pre-move King up there, don't care what he does. I need him to try and take. Oops. Oh, that's excellent, that's what I wanted. I didn't lose it, I could have easily lost that game, but very well done. I'm going to play a gambit line here. Okay, pawn forward. Ooh, he played a bit too quick there. So I've got knight in. Hmm. Right, we threaten a check. There's no queen check, I hope I'm not missing one. He goes back. So bishop up to again threaten the check, which he's allowed. And then, hold on. I've got bishop check. Oh, he just resigns. I had bishop or queen going forward there. Okay, mm, let's play another Karakhan. prompt him to come forward and just weaken his defence. Hmm. Okay, let's just play a rook across, try not to blunder any tactics. Ok, 
okay, I think I'm okay, rock across. He comes forward, so I can't take, but I can play knight back. So now we are threatening to take, so bishop back, or you might run the risk of your bishop getting trapped. Okay, again, he's playing really, really well, he really is. So I've got knight over. I look to try and get an advanced knight of my own. At some point we're going to try and burst forward. Okay, so that pawn is a problem. I'm going to allow him to take it, rook and pawn, for two knights if he goes for it. But of course, you've got to be wary about the queen getting over here. That's what he's looking for. That's what he wants. So I'm going to challenge that knight. He either takes the pawn or he takes the knight. He goes for the knight. Alright, so now it's safe to take this one, or I can pawn up. Now let's just take it, eliminate the risk. Back and cover the check. Go forward. If he takes, I can undouble my pawns, or I can go with a rook, probably the pawn. If he doesn't, I've got a solid base. But it's going to be hard to break forward, though, very hard, whatever he does. Okay, so pawn forward. back in look across he's got a loose pawn there it's easy to miss that the pawn is actually loose right now I'm going to try and open this if he takes he doesn't so I'll hit the pawn it defends it Right, so protect this pawn and play across. Well, that's a good move. It's a good move. Very good. Right, I'm going to allow him to take the rook. He's got to be careful now, his pawn hangs. My king is perfectly safe here. So this pawn hangs, this pawn hangs, so he has to be careful. Okay, take what he can. I just realised that I need a blunder down queen check. Get the queen up. Oh, that was a mistake. his rating he really did really well I think I'll play somewhat different this game okay comes forward so it's kind of a Karakhan position anywhere now So I can hit the bishop, push him back, or I can trade and open up. I like the idea of taking. So hit bishop. Get rid of it. Hit the knight. Hmm. Let's block with a queen. Oh god, I've blundered it. I blundered the queen. Yes, he's seen it. Well done. Well done. I'd seen it as soon as I played it. As soon as I played it, I'd seen it. Do 
So you knight forward, then I can always bring the other knight this side. Okay, just go forward. Probably bishop might come over, it goes back. So hit the pawn. Comes forward, I can take there. So now we're threatening moves like knight. Okay, look to just trade. Um, let's grab another pawn. Hope that we're not getting the rook in the deep, deep doo doo. So pin the bishop. Now we're threatening knight over to hit the bishop which is pinned. It is protected, but at least we'd get rid of it. So still hit the bishop. Okay, so he hits rook. Rook can come down, but ah, I can take. And then I hit the queen and the two rooks anyway. Right, let's take that one. Alright, so pin the knight. Oh, the queen was free. What am I doing? He dropped his queen and I missed it. Again, as soon as you make a move, you see it. As soon as you make a move, you actually see it. Clearly he'd seen it. Wow. That is unforgivable to miss that. Let's just run the pawn. Right, rook across. So if the knight moves, I'm just going to take. So he can't move his knight. Even he can't move there, I can still take the rook. Just push the pawn. So this should still be comfortably winning. Uh, try and make sure I don't blunder it. Make sure I don't blunder a back rank. Oh, and I might have done. I might have done. Wow. I've got the bishop that can block, but three pieces should be too strong for the queen. So we're looking at knight across if we can. Right. Make sure the king's got a nice square. Took the king away. So now knight over this way instead. Put it on a safe square. Right, hit the queen, protect the rook and threaten a check. So grab the pawn. Okay. Offers a draw, no I don't want to draw. I'm perfectly safe, so I think it's worth taking a risk here. Bishop protects the rook, knight's protected, knight's got a check and then we can just queen. He might have missed that, I can queen next move. Get the queen off the board. That's just an easy one now. Simply playing too fast in the opening when you don't need to. It's very easy to forget that these are two minute bullet games, not three minute, not um, one minute bullet games. Let's just try and get another piece off the board. Oh, he's blundered another one. Okay. That's just simply playing too fast, that. Whoa, he's going berserk mode, okay. Let's just play solid sensible. I don't think take is the recommended move there. Take, bishop, check, I'm sure is all right. There is a weird gambit line here where you can sack your queen almost. There's some sort of very weird gambit in some lines here where you can sack your queen. He's going to come in, I'll take. Knight supports knight, now I'll get castle. Okay, I can either go back or I can go forward and chuck the bishop. F5 is intriguing. 
Actually, I've got Queen check as well. Let's throw in a check and then the bishop. Oh, have I blundered it? No, I haven't, have I? Hmm. Has to be the queen there. Right, hit the bishop. Ooh, nearly got a check there. Doesn't quite work. Okay, that's much nicer now that the queen's off the board. Why didn't I take the bishop there? Just simplify. I don't need to, do I? Mm. Yeah, let's take. So I take the pawn, he takes me with a check. So I've really got a take, but now there's a back rank mate issue. So I'm going to run the king out. Yeah, that was purely because he went into berserk mode, so I could take my time with it. Okay, that's plain English. Okay, I'll take. So I can take there. I think I'll just play up. So he should push the pawn, he doesn't. Again, I rarely play the English, so I could easily be blundering something here. Right, so there's obviously just a cheeky little hit on the knight. It's easy to miss. He doesn't miss it. Ooh, so I could actually take now. And he takes... Yeah, I can't get away with take, take. Check doesn't quite work. I'll come back. I'll play the knight in, I'm guessing. And rook across. Or maybe queen up. Oh, he comes over, okay. Oh no, I'll definitely take. Knight on a very nice square. Just got to get the rook across so it's off this diagonal with the bishop. Uh, there's no tricks there, is it? Uh, for myself, I meant. Okay, so I'm hitting the pawn and protecting a pawn. Right, grab the pawn. So threaten another pawn. Can I even look at moves like knight down to trap his rook? Is it playable? Not sure it is. Ooh, bishop down. Wow. So grab a pawn. Doesn't threaten anything. Knight down hits the queen. Let's just grab a pawn. Keep it simple. Ooh. I've nearly missed the threat there, but the knight covers his bishop coming in. 
but I could trade rook for rook if I really have to. Don't want to, of course, but I could. Am I threatening to take? I don't think I am. Right, the bishop's off, so I'm doing fine now. Hit the bishop and try and drop the bishop back. Just stop the rooks being connected. Right, now I should be very comfortable. Pawns protected by the bishop. Mistake. I'll just run the pawn up, that should be good enough. Yeah, there's nothing he can do there now, is there? That's a very good win. Mm, make this pawn first. Excellent, we got that. Excellent win. Play this. Is Queen up a move? I'm not sure. Okay. Pawn up just feels wrong. Ooh. Play a move to give the knight an escape square if I need it. Okay, so if I take, he takes with a knight. That's obviously not good. So drop back. If he takes, I can take with the bishop. Now I've got to be wary that my bishop... Actually, my bishop is guarded by the knight. So if his knight moves, I can still take his bishop just fine. I've got to get the knight out, though. And that's probably the best route. Okay, so bring the knight back in over. Okay, let's just hit the knight, throw in a nuisance move. It's not really doing anything, it's just a nuisance move. Make him think of it. Okay, so I'll... Hmm. Yeah, let's trade off my bishop, that's not doing much. So I'll threaten a pawn. Now try and move this knight out of the way. Okay, do I mind that pawn? I'll put a knight up. It has the benefit of hitting this pawn as well. I can't go back, so... If I go forward, I'm hitting the pawn. Okay. Now if he takes there, I've got to check first before I take back, otherwise I'll lose the rook. Important to note. Right, hit the pawn. I really need to play this as well because he's got diagonals. 
with my king. So he's kind of pressured me into that. Can I get away with this? Hold on, pray I'm not getting checkmated, which I might be now. Wow. If he checks, I've got to go on one of the other squares, whichever one's available, otherwise, I've got no move. He's just looking to see how he mates me. If he doesn't, he's going to lose on the clock. Oh, he does there, doesn't he? He does indeed there. He might have won. Wow. Wow, got there. Got there. I didn't realise I had that much time left, actually. Mm, I didn't realise I had nine seconds there. Well, that's a very good win. So he's going berserk mode as well, so let's play solid. So this means he's basically just got a normal one minute bullet time, which is plenty of time for somebody, you know, a strong player. <coughs> mm, let's take that. Trading there. Can I grab the pawn? So the checks are covered, he goes back. Offer to trade queens, I've got a potential check. Take, take, but I definitely lose a pawn, so I'll protect. Oh, I should have taken anyway. What am I doing? That was silly. So I'm going to give him pawn back. I can't protect the pawn. But if he takes a knight, he loses a piece. But he trades a piece, I mean. So my pawns are on light squares apart from the ones... Oh, he's dropped his bishop. Wow. What on earth happened there? That was just a complete brainwave he had there. Yeah, he's just had a complete brainwave there, hasn't he? And I'm a bit lucky. an easy one now. And I've got lots and lots of time just to wrap that up. That's an excellent win against the 2300. They don't happen very often at my rating level. Wow, there are 4,732 players in. Another 2300. <coughs> Ooh, a little bit of a cough. Now, I had this in a game earlier, didn't I? I went up and then eventually I tried this sack. So I'm going to try it again. It won't work against the 2300, of course, but we're just having fun passing a bit of time in an online tournament, so why not? So we're just going to play bishop up if we can. Ooh, 
Do you want us to open it up? Really open it up, okay. Hmm. Hmm, I don't think I can really defend that pawn, can I? Well, actually I can castle. But I could be warping in, walking into the viper's den with this move. I've got to play up. Don't grab that pawn like that. Oh. I think I can now. Okay, so I could take, he takes... Are there any tricks? I've got bishop up to I this square. Hmm. My gut feeling is just to push on there. I don't know why. It's just a gut feeling. Okay, so I could take there. Okay, I have the feeling it's a bad idea. So my king can't go either of them squares now, the bishop's cut it off, so I'll have to run this way if he checks. But I have got a rook blocker though. But my bishop is completely dead and out of the game here, so that's obviously a problem. I think I'll bring rook up, hit the pawn. Interesting though, interesting game. When I lose, it's been an interesting game. Okay, I can't take. No. Is that a blunder as well? It is, isn't it? I have to go across and he gets a check, so I have to obviously block. Very, very neatly done there. I say players at this level really are a little bit out of my league, or they should be. Ooh, that's a bad move. He might be able to sack there. Wow, I got there. Point one of a second. Point one of a second. Wow. See, my mouse speed is terrible, and I know it's terrible. I don't have the mouse speed to compete with players at this level in pure bullet. So, wow, I was very lucky there, but we'll take it, though. So again, he should be too good for me. If he turns up and plays at his best, he'll be a bit too good for me. But let's see what happened. He goes back, so I think we're okay just to trade there and bring the other knight up. Just very classical Karakan opening. Okay, so this is where we have to see if it's possible to unwind. 
I'm going to chuck a palm up if I can. Okay. So connect the rooks. I'm not to push a pawn up anywhere. I don't think he'll take there. I think he'll just drop back. He does. So let's push a pawn on again. I could easily get into a pickle here though against a strong player. So bishop up. Is that a move? I think I'll bring rook across and maybe sack the rook for the dangerous bishop. If I could sack the rook for bishop and double his pawns up, I think I'd play it. So bishop over, he wants the rook across. Hmm. I think I'll just play rook across, give the bishop a path back. Yeah, so he wants his rook across and he's got it across. So I've got to hit that rook. I think maybe queen up if he goes off this file. Oh, he doesn't, he grabs the pawn, okay. So let's play up and try and keep the rook boxed over a bit. I'm gonna try and play queen up and see if I can trade queens. Oh, he takes the knight, okay. So he can get another pawn. Oh my neck. Right. Gotta be wary about him getting a rook here and then the bishop obviously hanging. So he might be looking to try and play that now. So let's play up if the rook moves trade queens. Even if he grabs the pawn, I'm so up on time I can afford to take the risk. Hmm, I don't think I can wangle this kind of for a still there. Nope. Well done. Well done. He outplayed me in the end. Very well finished. Oh, oh Fico Corrales. Plays in Arena Kings, I believe. Very, very strong player. Grandmaster, so... I think it's going to be a tough match. Okay, which way can I go there? Actually, I think I'm going to sack. Okay, I'm not going to take there. Check. Am I walking into a checkmate back rank here? I might be. My queen does defend this square though. Queen defends the square. So the knight doesn't hit the queen now. The queen defends the rook check back rank mate. Okay, let's play up. There's almost a lovely puzzle rush there with takes, takes and pins. I don't think it'll work, but I mean if his queen wanders off, I'm actually threatening a mate. Okay, let's just go forward anywhere. Oh, he might have had my bishop there actually, my bishop's stuck, isn't it? Hmm. So 
So he hits the rook. <coughs> oh, I've blundered the piece. Okay. Well played. I just missed that. go now. I think I sack a pawn here if I remember. Yeah, if he checks I think I have to take. Okay, I can take that. It leaves me wide open though to getting his bishop and queen in a triangle like this, so this could be a bit hairy scary now. Yeah, I've just played a poor game here. I think this is close to being resignation time. Okay. It comes forward, so can I risk anything? Hmm. I can't even go there, wow. So I've got to play this really. So this is just kind of a, a poor loss really. I'll take. Okay. Hmm. Well, he has to still support his rook. So there's a fork. That might win a piece back. But he's still got that many pawns, he should be just fine. Gotta grab the pawn. I really need the pawn here. Pawn there and I'm just fine. Pawn there and I'm just fine. Have I given him check? No, but I can take. I can take a check. Wow, I've got chances. Okay, I'll offer him a draw because I'm down the clock and I don't think he'll take it, he doesn't. Did me on time, wow. I should have had a result there. Just play a holding move. 
start a minority attack. Let's see if we can loosen this structure up. I think the polymer looks fine. Okay, take. Bring both rooks across. So maybe Queen back just to break any pen. So he's played a holding move himself. Just to make sure he doesn't get back round. Okay. Let's take the pawn, hit the bishop. So now I'm a pawn up, I should be doing fine here. Knight in looks dangerous. I can hit the queen and knight and get the knight off the board maybe, but don't know I like the look of that. No, I think I do like the look of that. If rook across, I take the queen. Okay. I'm threatening a knight check. I'm hitting the rook. I'm looking to trade the queens. Okay. Now it's time to take and just hope I'm not going to get back ranked. Yeah, let's try and go for the seventh rank. Question is can I pick off these pawns before I lose these? Wow, well, he's pushing my king to where it kind of needs to be. I think that was a mistake. I think I can take. Well played, that's a good solid result though. Very good solid result. Over 5,000 players in the event now. 51 minutes to go. I could take the pawn if he takes that. Uh... Okay, let's double his pawns. It comes forward, so I think knight up is okay. Then maybe put knight out wide. Surely I can take there, does not win a pawn. Gotta be careful of the knight of course, but what happens if I take? Lose a knight, take again. Hmm. Then he takes. If knight back, he can take. Now it's gotta be right to bring the knight back. Just case of what I do now. I think pawn forward, pawn forward. Maybe even pawn forward here with knight up. That looks quite strong. Okay, the bishop can always drop back if it needs, but I want to create a square so I can put the knight forward. Okay. So let's go forward. So 
So now I'm threatening to take the pawn. His rook's going to be in a bit of trouble here. So he might have to trade. Comes up, up. Let's play rook across while I think about this. He's going to grab the pawn. So I have to take. So I've blundered a piece, so this is probably over. Yes, yes, yes. Very well done. Hmm. Wow. Should be fine for a draw, but I blundered the win there. Should have been a win, but well played. Hmm. Penguin is at the top, Andrew Tank. Ali Reserves there, fifth. Tight battle. That's Daniel Naroditsky. Rebecca Harris. Very close at the top. Where to put the bishop? Oh, drop back, I think. Okay, not just yet. Rook across. Hmm. I think I'm going to drop the bishop right back. Knight back to the other side of the board. Right, so we can kick the knight, can we? Uh, we'll challenge that knight first. Hope I'm not blundering something. So I can always take this knight with a bishop. I've got pawn up, what does he do? Okay. Hmm. I've got to go back there to stop his rook coming in. Now I can go forward. Unless I trade bishop for knight. But now if we come in, I can play rook across anyway, I think. Right, that simplifies a little bit. I think I'll go forward. And I'm going to push again. Okay. Give it an isolated pawn and try and claim an open file. So check. And if rook down, do I have bishop up to hit the queen? Bishop hits the queen. He has to still defend the rook. Hmm. I don't want to trade there if I can help it. I want to try and edge the pawns forward, but I'm well down on the clock this game. Well down. So I've got to find a way to win some material. Hmm. Yes. 
very nice move and I'm just completely busted on time right I'm gonna trade the rook now and trust my end game skills Okay, that's a draw. Well played. Right, National Marder, a 20, 26 80 National Master, so very strong player. Is it a check? That threatens a check. I've got to take the knight. Okay, the queen is completely misplaced here. Has he got a move like rook takes? That's always a danger, of course. Oh, I've just walked into checkmate. What am I doing? Just gifted him it. Wow. Okay, he hasn't bought to make a move. Wow, 94 points for a penguin. Oh, he advances. Okay, let's take up the challenge. Right, so we can simplify. I think I better let him take. Just try and castle if I can. Okay, knight over. Right, now we've castled, we need to try and think about attacking. Oh, and have I blundered a piece just like that? I've got to take the queen. Wow. I think that's forced. Well, we should have just grabbed the pawn there, that's a bit odd. Hmm. I've got to go this way. Okay. My only hope is to push forward here with the pawn stone. It's my only hope here, my only realistic hope is to try and get these forward. Okay, now can I go up there? I think I can. It's not as clean as it could have been, is it, for my opponent? Yeah, there's nothing I can do there, so we're in a 
we're in a tournament, get on with the next one, well played. Okay, if I'd known he was going berserk, I would have stuck to something more sensible. I normally play a knight f3, so I would have stuck to that. Okay, I've got to leave that there. Right, hit the rock. Clearly a very dangerous position I've gotten myself into here. Hmm. Yeah. Forced to trade queens, I don't really want to do this. Oh, I don't want to grab the pawn, but now my queen can come back. Oh, I've blundered it anyway. I have indeed. Done, I missed that. Well played. Ooh, that's very bold, isn't it? Okay, I just tried it in the last. Last game I played it didn't work, so let's try it again. Take up the challenge. Now I can win a pawn there. Now can I play a pawn up? Hmm. It's a very nice move, that. Very, very good. I'm going to play g6. If he takes, I'll take and it supports the structure. But now I'm completely bogged down. Could be interesting though. I'm a piece down the sacrifice, but I've got three pawns, not two. That could be interesting. Clearly I'm just going to castle, he's going to castle. And I'm going to try and do my best to expand. He'll either take or he'll retreat and I'll go forward. The idea is just to try and open this up now. Before we get blown off the board. So just go forward. If he takes, I can take a pawn. So he goes back. Okay, this could be a bit dangerous now because I can get rook across potentially on the file. Hmm, far from easy though, far from easy this. Okay. So rook across he can just take the pawn. So let's go forward, see if he takes the bishop, then try and bring the other rook across. I'm threatening to move the knight and his queen is pinned. So he moves. So I'll move, hit the bishop. If he takes, I'll take with a rook. Actually, no, I'll take with a queen. Because he's so short a time. I'd be very happy indeed to get the queen off the board. Alright, that should be enough to win now. Got to check. 
Hmm. So the knight moves, the bishop falls. Well, that should be good enough. Excellent, that's a good win. What have we got? 34 minutes left. So I'm in 319th out of 5,369. That's very good. Wow, Ali Reza's jumped to the top. Wow. He's done that out of nowhere. Okay, I could have played f6 there to stop the knight coming in, but I'll keep it sensible. Actually, let's take with a bishop. Hmm. Yeah, it could easily be in trouble this game. Got to try and get one of these knights off. There's a mid threat, so I can drop back. Actually, I've got pawn up there, but he's got knight takes, so I've got to drop back. He's still got a knight check though. King across, he can take a rook, so he can go rook for knight, which I'd be happy with given the position I've gotten in. So let's take with a bishop. So we are threatening to go up and fork the pieces. Okay, he had knight check otherwise. So now it's time to take. Hmm. I want to play a pawn up, but he takes. I've got a play over there, but I'm just completely busted now, aren't I? I must be. If the queen's come off, you never know. You never know. Take with the bishop. Hmm, actually, let's go on the other side. I just hold the pawn for the time being. Oh, that's a blunder. Now I've got chances. Or have I? Ooh. How's your look? I feel like trying to play on. Yes, he took the right way, well done. Nothing I can do now, he's played very, very well there to finish that. Oh, I dropped the pawn. Just checkmate, well done. <coughs> well played, good finish. Oops, you must not pre-move there, okay. Hmm. Why is he going so fast? We've 
we've got this really unusual position. I think I'll just castle, I'll just bail out of that. Okay, knight forward, does it threaten anything? Possibly. If I can take the knight, I will do. <coughs> Obviously, I've got bishop back to hit the queen, but I'm going to double his pawns. Hmm. Let's go forward. Drop back. Ooh. Okay, so he's let me get the rook forward. Oh, he comes forward. Wow. So I've got to stop his queen coming in. No, I can't play that, but I can go forward. Oh, I've dropped a clanger. I did not mean to do that. He just has a rook check, does he? Okay, I can check. Oh, that's a dreadful move. What did I play that for? He's just got to move his rook out of the way, which he does. Oh, there isn't a check. Oh, I've dropped a clanger. Dropped a clanger. Terrible. All right, we have a Fide Master. This will be a tough game. All title players... They're very strong, of course. I've reached at least 22, 2300. Okay. Hmm. I've just blundered a pawn immediately there. He should have taken the pawn. Okay, so I've just had this in my last game. I can't remember if this works or not. Clearly, it doesn't. It's a disaster. Oh, that's just a dreadful game. Right, Karakhan. Okay, let's take that. Mm, let's just play up in Castle. comes forward, okay. So I've got to take. Wow, I've just blundered a piece. What on earth am I doing? What on earth am I doing? Wow. That is shocking. That is disgraceful. Gotta watch out for this, of course. I think Kai will drop the bishop back. If pawn down, I think knight over looks fine. <coughs> right, knight in first. So I think 
Look across. Look across again. Potentially go forward, but try not to drop this night. Okay, switches sides. I've got to watch this bishop hitting the knight. It's so easy to forget these things. So I'm going to play rook up to support the knight. Right now I'm going to drop the knight back. There's a queen trade on offer. Okay, drops back. So again, offer a queen trade. Okay. covers the pawn. That's a good move. I've got to try and stop him from completely flooding this side. So I can go over and hit the queen. Now I've got to take that. But now it's a little bit easier to bring the knight back into play. And now I've got to start mortaring. Takes a take with a rook. Blundered the rock, wow. So easy to do. Now I've just blundered this key square. Shocking. Terrible blunder, terrible. And have I got pawn forward? Maybe I had pawn forward, I don't know. Just been far too slow, I've got nothing have I? I give him that, well done, <coughs> got nothing there. Right, five and a half thousand players in the event now, 20 minutes to go. I'm on a bit of a losing streak right now after a pretty decent start. B4 I think is right first. If he takes it, okay. Oh, he comes in, okay. So take, bishop takes, I'm going to get another piece lost. So when I advance, I've got to protect these. Hmm. Oh, I grab a pawn. If his queen wanders off, I've got rook takes knight, so I'll do that. He's going to check, but then I can drop the rook back. So now, ooh. Have I blundered it again? I want to play pawn up, but I lose the knight. Hmm. Wow. So I've got pawn up, rook takes, rook takes, queen takes. I've got to give him that pawn, unfortunately. 
So I'm completely bogged down again. What on earth can I do here? I think rook across. Yeah, this is just a complete nightmare of a position now, isn't it? Can I maybe play pawn up, pawn up? No, I've just played an absolute shocker of a game again here. Got nothing. Sacrifice clearly didn't work. Hmm. Pawn up, he's going to just pin the rook, that's what I would do. Then he's got a queen check and it's over. Oh, it's check. Wow. That's another shocking game, that is terrible. Right, 17 minutes left. I must have lost five in a row there, I think, or six in a row. Probably six in a row there. just completely simplify the position. Okay, I'm going to actually go queen side this time. Knight takes, Queen's protected. Has he got Bishop down tricks like this? Rook across, and then he just plays Bishop takes. Wow, he's taken. Okay, so I might be missing a mating attack here, I probably am. He played it very confidently there, didn't he? So I might be missing a mating attack somewhere here. I mean, what compensation have I got for this poor king position? I mean, knight over, is it playable? Bishop check, the king can't run. Oh, he's resigned, wow. He resigned, I think he should have played on there. Right, feed it. Faster. He's gone at Berserk mode. He's a 2500. I don't think is the right move, but let's trade. Oh, please tell me I'm not going to blunder my knight. Okay. 
Special Taker, I think. Okay, I've got to take there. Have I got pawn up there? No, I can't have. Well, that's a very good draw against the 2500 Fido Master. Very good. Play going berserk, so I'll try and play a solid game. Hmm. I think I'll go with a pawn there. Yeah, he's going a little bit too quick almost, so let's just waste a couple of moves. certainly messed that up. That was not quite what I planned. Pawn's protected so we can take the bishop, why not? Nice fork there. Should have took the knight first of course but now it's a nice pin. That's a rook. How do I get my queen forward? Mm. How do I get forward? I want to play rook across. Okay, I'm just going to cut that diagonal completely. Actually, yeah, bishop back. I've got a very nice square. This is all nicely guarded. He's in a heap full of trouble now. I might have to drop a rook back, of course, to guard the position, but just play a holding move. Right, so, rook across to guard, now we can look to expand. Rook down and across. Queens. lovely win. That's an excellent win. Excellent. <coughs> well, that's Daniel at the top now. Wow, the lead is changing, isn't it? I wonder if some of these players are not playing all the games. I wonder if some of them are not playing the whole lot. Okay, queen up. Knight up is the right move. Oh, that's a mistake. Hmm. Yeah, let's fiend kettle. Okay. Let's go right across the board. Right, first bit done. So 
I'm hitting a pawn there. Oh, I could have just took the bishop, couldn't I? Why didn't I? I go a pawn, rook across. I don't see why not. Just come straight back. In fact, the rook can't go across because of the bishop, so you would just take. Knight over now. It does allow the rook to go across. Okay, now it's simplified. That's good. We want pawn forward, just to release the bishop potentially, or pawn forward here. God, it's so easy to make mistakes when you play bullet chess for a couple of hours. So easy to make mistakes. Okay, so now I've got bishop up. Okay, so I've still got bishop up, but I've got pawn up, I think. What's he done? Pawn down. Can I take? Oh, I've dropped the rook. Just dropped the rook, haven't I? Wow. So I've got bishop up, he gets queen up, pawn up. Actually, I think it's playable. Ah, oh, he had queen up anyway, didn't he? So I've got four pawns for the piece. Question is, are they any good? Well, let's simplify the position. If I get my king in, the pawns could be very good. Oh, I've blooded the rook. He just takes it. Wow, I just gave him a free rook. He missed it. Right now he's allowed the check. Oh, I lost on time. I don't believe it. How did I lose that game? Just not fast enough, but well played. My opponent hung on very well. Well done. So Daniel is back top. That's Ali Reza. That's Penguin. Well, there's only five minutes left, so maybe two more games and that's it. Okay, my opponent's chosen to go berserk, so I'll try and play a solid line. Okay, that's a free piece, I think. You just gotta be a little bit careful. Now let's go back that way. I'm not sure why I didn't just take the knight while he could. So take, take. Hmm, I've got to drop back, don't I? So this could still be very awkward. Okay, now do I mind about the pawn? Don't think I do actually. Night in, night in. Ooh. Okay. That 
definitely lets me in with a chance. Oh, why didn't I play a queen check or something? That's got to be one, surely. Yeah, excellent. That's a good win. 5,706 pleasant. Right, another feeder master. Let's play the Nims of Witch Gambit, why not? Oh, he takes, okay. Now, how do I normally play this? I think I normally actually play a bishop up there. Although this line is fine as well. Okay. I think you take there, if I remember. That's an excellent win. He didn't know how to play against it or he just played too quick. That's an excellent win. It's so easy to do when you've played two hours of bullet. No. If you watch through my tournament here I've dropped an awful lot of clangers. And a 2200 again to finish or likely finish. Okay. Let's play a different line. The bishop up is the other way you can play the two knights. Knight back, okay. Just gotta try and make sure I don't blunder my pieces here. Now that is Castle King side, it makes it a little bit easier for me to do the same. Yeah, castle first, knight back. Actually, do I need a knight back? I'm not sure I do. Let's go forward. Okay, knight comes over. So I can win a pawn. I've got to go that way though. Hmm, let's play it across, supported by the queens, now the knight can move. Takes, so let's go forward. Right, so how do we target these? Knight over looks strong. So he cuts that out, so bishop back. So again, knight over looks a strong move. Hmm. I think I'll offer him a draw there, you never know, he may take it, he doesn't. Is there a weakness there? Hit the bishop and pressure on the pawn. Well, let's get a pawn forward. down on the clock, that's the one big concern here. Right, that's solid, he can't touch that. He's got to be very careful. Oh, and I blundered the pawn. So we both have to be very careful. I mean, kind of in Zug's <coughs> lost this now. Yeah, it's just hopeless.
was the net given that? Well played. So Daniel did indeed win it. Oh, I've come 414. So that's not bad, is it? 53 points, 414 out of 5,732. My performance of 2,106. Average opponent 2091. 45% win rate out of 40 games. Had some very, very good wins there. Beat that Fide Master. Got a draw with another 2,500 Fide Master. Um, got a game against a Grandmaster. Had a couple of other very, very good wins in the event there. Yeah, beat a 2300. I think I beat a few of them. So very, very, very good. And I'll just have a quick look at the um, leaders before I finish this. Only five points in it. Daniel won it by five points. Ali was a third. Penguin fourth. All incredibly good players. So thank you to anybody who watches this.